Anytime the ultra lift is stored in the stock room, it should be hooked up to the battery charger. It's not necessary to remove the battery box cover to charge the battery. Keep the drive screw and ball nut lubricated with Super Lube or TriFlow to reduce friction in the moving parts. Never use WD-40 or grease. Run the frame the length of the drive screw twice to remove excess lubrication. You can also use these same lubricants to maintain the frame rollers. Regularly use the inspection checklist to report any mechanical or structural problems. Level, you'll need to replace it. For safety, wear a pair of approved safety glasses or goggles. Remove the two screws that hold the battery box cover in place and lift off the lid. Remove and save the spacer block. Use two wrenches to loosen the battery terminal connectors. Always disconnect the negative blue terminal first. Also, be careful not to touch the wrenches to the metal battery box or you could possibly cause a spark or arc if there is power left in the battery. Next, disconnect the positive terminal connector and move the wires out of your way. Lift the dead battery out of the battery box. To install the new battery, make sure the battery cables are out of your way and lower the new one in place. Reconnect the positive red terminal first and then connect the negative blue terminal. Again, be careful not to touch the wrenches to any metal. Replace the spacer block and the battery box lid and tighten the cover screws. Check the meter and charge the battery if necessary.